Welcome to another edition of the Tom Green Show. How are we doing tonight? Glad to be back on this show, but I gotta apologize for my voice here since I'm a little bit under the weather. Got a bit of a cold, that's why I got some water with me. Okay, so anyway, to our week three fantasy picks. But before that, we got to um, make a shout out or two. Um, one thing is, I do have a, a soundboard for the show. Glad to say that. It's been in the works for a while. First of all, we got to fire this thing up. There we go, it's all fired up. First thing, I make a shout out to uh, three guys that were at the uh, soccer game today that I did for a media class at school, and they call themselves Free the, the Zellas. It's a campaign to get Vuvu Zellas back in the game of soccer. We all miss that sound, don't we? I hope so. Because... <laughs> of course I had to do that. So anyway, with our fantasy picks... Let's get ready to rumble. Are you ready? Oh, yes, 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 yes. So anyway, to our picks. The Essexville Green Monsters, they have been at 2-0, facing the Continental Gladiators and Jordan Bennett. Quarterbacks, we have Big Ben Roethlisberger from us against Tony Romo. And of course, we all know who's going to win. Ben Roethlisberger. But NFL.com says Tony Romo is going to win. <laughs> that was my dog Pudge, by the way. Anyway, what was that again? Tony Romo is going to win. Tony Romo is going to win. It's Tony Romo! Come on! Come on! Pudge, please. please. Pudger just loves to bark. Anyway, running backs for this week. Michael Turner against Arian Foster. This time, NFL.com has got Arian Foster expected to win. This one is a dramatic scene, though. Anyway. Other running backs, we got Green, Ben Jarvis Green Ellis against Ryan Matthews. Ryan Matthews expected to win that one. Wide receivers, we got Megatron going up against Andre Johnson, not Calvin Johnson's brother. This time they got it right though. Megatron expected to win. Danny Amendola against San Antonio Holmes. Amendola expected to win that one. Excellent. And in tight ends, I decided to bench um, Jermichael Finley this week and put in Brent Selleck because it's hammer time. Against Rob Gronkowski. Gronkowski expected to win that one. And in our flex players, but first before we do that, flex players, we got CJ Spiller, who had a great week last week against Des Bryant. 
CJ Spiller expected to win that one. Kickers this week. Matt Prater against David Akers. Akers, of course, the one that hit the 63-yard field goal. Akers expected to win that one. Defenses. We got the Bears against the Texans. Unfortunately, the Texans are going to win that one. And sadly, the Continental Gladiators are expected to win 154 to 118 once again. But, as they say in school, we all know that the Monsters are going to pull it out for some, some way, somehow. Of course, for good luck. So anyway, NFL matchups this week. Now, let's see here. First, we start with Thursday night's game, Carolina against the Giants. CJ picked Carolina, while Dwayne and I both picked the New York Giants. Going to Sunday, Dallas against Tampa. We all picked America's team. <sighs> Colts against Jacksonville, we all picked the Colts. Cleveland against Buffalo, Buffalo on the road, we all picked Buffalo. Bills. Miami against the Jets, we all picked the Jets on the road. New Orleans against Kansas City, we all picked New Orleans at home. Saints are 0-2, surprisingly, in all their um, Saints Bounty Program investigations. In fact, Jonathan Vilma has been hearing from the NFL. Hopefully he doesn't get suspended or else he's going to get a... I love this soundboard. Anyway, uh, Washington and Cincinnati. RG3. We all picked RG3 to win that one. Bears against the Rams. We all picked the Bears. Minnesota against San Fran. We all picked San Fran. Tennessee against Detroit. Detroit on the road. We picked Detroit, of course. Lions. To the late games, we got San Diego against Atlanta. I picked San Diego, while the other two picked Atlanta. Cardinals against Philadelphia. Landon picked the Cardinals. CJ and I picked Philadelphia. Oakland against Pittsburgh. We all picked the Steelers. Broncos in Houston. Landon went with Peyton Manning, while both CJ and I both went with Matt Schaub. Houston. Sunday night game. Baltimore against New England. I went with Baltimore. The other two went with New England. And then on Monday night, Seattle against Green Bay. We all went Packers. Last week, I was the only one with a winning record. 9-7 and seven against Landon 7-9 and nine and CJ 6-10. and 10. So after week 2, the standings. I am in the lead 20-12. 20, 20 and 12. CJ is 18-14 and 14, and the loser right now is Landon at 17-15. and 15. And so of course before we go, we got to do some of these sounds here like the this one. And finally, for our last sound, drum roll please, or that's a doorbell, excuse me, drum roll. Here's how we end the show with... We'll see you all later.
Peace out.